If you sign into multiple Google accounts into Chrome, today I'm going to show you a tip on how to quickly switch between those accounts for Gmail. So how Chrome handles multiple Google accounts is two different ways. You can sign in to each account in the same Google Chrome profile, but this intermingles all of the bookmarks and the history. So if you're signed into the account with your school account and your personal account, well, all of that information gets bundled up together. and You probably don't want to do that, but sometimes you have to do that. If you don't want to do that, check out my creating Google Chrome profiles link down in the description. But if you are logged into Google Chrome with multiple Google accounts and want to switch between Gmail quickly, that's what today's tip is for. I have this Google Chrome set up with different profiles. Also, I'm signed into this profile with multiple Google accounts. Google Chrome supports multiple profiles and each profile is like it's totally separate instance of Google Chrome. Nothing talks to each other into the different profiles. But in a profile, you can also have multiple Google accounts. Clear as mud, right? Up here in the, in the toolbar, this is my account signed into this profile. And down here are other profiles set up in Chrome. So when I select Jenna here, you notice the browser looks totally different because Jenna's profile is totally separate. Again, check out the creating Chrome profiles link down in the description but you can also be signed into multiple Google accounts in the same Chrome profile. And that's, I'm on the Google page, so you can just see it. That's what this is, this icon within the browser window. I'm as my training user, but I also have Jenna's account. And to switch between the two, I have to click on the icon, the avatar, and then click on the account. Now, once I'm in Jenna's, I can click Gmail. But if I want to go back to my training Gmail, I have to click up here on and click training, which that works okay. It's still, it'd be really nice to be able to go directly, jump directly to the Gmail account, which is what I'm going to show you today. So I'm in the training. I'm signed in. This Google Chrome window has training signed in, and I want to make a link to go to Jenna's account. The link kind of looks like this. Behind this part is on every Gmail, and we're just adding this question mark, auth user, and then the email address that we want to go to. So I'm gonna put jenna.webster, which is her Google account. And when I go to it, even though I'm this window has training user, if I go to this URL, it's going to open up Jenna's email. And you can see that I'm Jenna. Well, that's great. I don't want to type that whole mess every time I want to go to Jenna or Training's account. So we're going to add that as a bookmark on the toolbar. Be sure to check out my bookmark all the things video. I'll put a link down there that shows you all sorts of neat tricks on easily accessing different sites in Google and the internet in general with the toolbar. We're going to cover a little bit of it here. So I'm going to add a page. Now when I select add a page, it selects the current page. We're going to change that. And let's make English people happy. Jenna's inbox. And the address, the URL, is mail.google.com slash mail slash you slash question mark auth user and then all that. That seems like a lot. You only have to do it once though. Now I have Jenna's inbox. Now let's make another one for my training inbox. Trainings inbox but I need to change the address to training and hit save. Now I have two icons here. I can hit trainings inbox and it goes right to my training. Hit Jenna's inbox, goes right to my Jenna's inbox. No matter where I am on the internet, I can jump right to Jenna's inbox or I can jump right to trainings inbox. Again, be sure to check out my bookmark all the things video to show you how to create folders and organize all your toolbar so it makes it really, really fast for you to use. That's it for my video today. I hope you got something out of it. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also, check out educate.me. Stay classy.